Dearly beloved, we've come together in the presence of God and the beauty of the season and place to witness and bless the joining together of you two, Jennifer and Austin, in holy matrimony. Jennifer, will you have this man to be your husband, to live together in the covenant of marriage? Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, be faithful to him as long as you both shall live? I do. And Austin, do you promise to have this woman as your wife, to live together in the covenant of marriage? Do you promise to love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, be faithful to her as long as you both shall live? Jennifer, I knew from the beginning that we were meant to be together. You're the most loyal, loving, giving person I've ever met. Me and all you are truly blessed to have you in our lives. Today, I take you as my wife. Our adventure's just begun, and I look forward to all the adventures that will come. I promise to love you and respect you for who you are. I will always there to be to support your goals and aspirations. I promise myself, I promise to better myself every day to be the loving husband you deserve. From this day to the rest of our lives, I promise to love you. I can't wait to start spending the rest of my life with you. Austin, you and I both know how indecisive I can be. I simply don't like to make decisions, especially when it comes to where we eat. But if there's one decision in my life that I know is the right one, it is to spend the rest of my life with you. You came into my life at exactly the right moment, when I wasn't ready, and yet when I needed you the most. I knew from the first time I met you that you were someone I didn't want I want you to know how honored and privileged and blessed I am, that even with all of my imperfections, you still chose me. You are my favorite person, and I choose you to be my partner in life. As your wife, I want to promise you a few things. I promise to love you with the same determination and confidence you've given me. I promise to put us first and make sure we are constantly growing, working to grow together. I promise to never change you as you have never tried to change me. I also promise to cuddle with you as much as I cuddle with Ollie, even though he might get a little jealous. <laughs> Most of all, I promise to love you always, no matter what. These are my solemn vows. Austin and Jennifer, these are the hands of your best friend, young and strong and full of love for you. These are the hands that will work alongside yours as together you build your future. These are the hands that will hold your children and grandchildren, that will comfort them in grief and hold them in affection. These are the hands that will passionately love you and cherish you through the years, and with the slightest touch will comfort you like none other. These are the hands that will wipe away from the tears from your eyes, or at least provide a tissue, tears of sorrow and tears of joy. And lastly, these are the hands that even when wrinkled and aged, will still be reaching for yours, still giving you that same unspoken tenderness with just a touch, as they are doing today on your wedding day. And now may God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit bless, preserve, and keep you. The Lord mercifully with his favor look upon you and give you all spiritual benediction and grace, that you may faithfully live together in this life and in the age to come have life everlasting. You, sir, may kiss the bride.